Hi, in this video, I'd like to show you how to sync contacts between two Google accounts. You may want to do this for a number of reasons. For example, perhaps you're a husband and wife who want to share the same contacts. Or perhaps you have a personal and a business account and you'd like to have the same contacts in both places. In this example, uh, we have 48 contacts under the John Adams account. John would like to give his wife, Mary, the same contacts. Currently, she doesn't have any. So the first step is to download the Contact Sync app. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, and now we're gonna open it. We'll grant it access to our contacts. And that brings us to the account screen. Uh, you'll notice that it shows uh, a Google account and an iPhone account because normally this app is used to sync Google with let's say iCloud. But in, in this example, we're gonna sync two Google accounts instead. So let's change modes. And then we need to sign into the first Google account. That's the John Adams account. And we also need to sign into Mary's account. All right, and we're done. So now we can proceed to sync. We'll press the sync button. And we can sync contacts in any direction. Um, let's go ahead and two-way sync. That just means that any, any changes made to John's contacts will go to Mary and vice versa. All right, it's prompting, prompting us to confirm the changes. Uh, there's basically 48 contacts that are gonna go from John to Mary, just like we'd expect. So let's confirm the sync and, let, and proceed. So it starts by creating five contact groups. And now it's it already created uh, 48 contacts under Mary's account. And now it's transferring the photos. As you'd expect, uh, the photo uploads is the step that takes the longest, uh, but it should be under a minute. And in the meantime, we can review the log and observe that uh, it created all the contacts under Mary's account, just like we'd expect. And uh, it, while we uh, did perform the sync in the foreground the first time, um, this is something that you can automate by setting up uh, auto sync in the app. And uh, thereafter, it can just um, sync your contacts in the, back, in the background. All right, the sync is complete. Let's verify that it worked. We'll go back to Safari. We're gonna refresh Mary's contacts and voila, 48 contacts. And you'll notice that uh, the groups are there as well. And so it worked. Uh, I hope that was helpful. Um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to email me. I'll leave uh, my email address in the description. Thank you.